Hey everyone, this is Armando speaking, and today I'll show you how to create shortcut commands in Adobe Illustrator. Alright, now in order to create these, you have to go to Edit, and select Keyboard Shortcuts. Now you see a list of tools and commands with its own shortcut next to it. Now, let's say we give the command Outline Stroke a shortcut since it's a very useful tool which is also hidden inside these menus. So I'll leave this panel and go to Object, Path, and Outline Stroke. Now you see that there is no shortcut command next to it, unlike Average which shortcut Alt, Command, and J for example. So let's go back to the keyboard shortcuts and look for the command Outline Stroke. Now see it is not considered as a tool, we have to select Menu Commands. And select Object, Path, and click on Outline Stroke. Now we have to select the shortcut and type in a name that would suit your own preferences again. And I'll go with Command, Shift, and D. Well, something prevented us from creating the shortcut. And the reason is, is that the shortcut command is already taken by another menu command. Now we can do two things. Either remove this command from the one that's using it right now, or create a new one. So let's say that we take the transparency grid command for the sake of this tutorial. All we have to do is click go to, which brings us directly to its command. So now we need a new command for it to work, or leave it out which it already did by default after clicking go to. So now I'll just leave it out for this time being because it's just a demonstration and it would take me a lot of time to make up a shortcut that wasn't already taken yet. All right, let's get back to the outline stroke. And click OK. Now it will ask you to save its key set which will serve as your customizable shortcut. So I'll go with Edmonda Science Key Set. And proceed. Now, when we're navigating through the menu and look up the command Outline Stroke, you'll see that the shortcut I just added in is right next to it. So let's try it out. First, I'll draw a line with the pen tool, shortcut P. and apply the outline stroke shortcut command, command, shift, and D to it. And there you have it. We've just converted the stroke to an outline with our new shortcut command, which is way more efficient than scrolling through the menus just to get this done. Now I hope that this was helpful to you, and that if you're stuck in the process or can't get something to work, then just place your question in the comment section below. Alright, have a good one.